All right, for people who've used barrels before, um, they, uh, um, they'll likely tell you that getting the barrel organized can be a bit of a challenge so that every time you go in there, what you're looking for isn't at the bottom of the barrel because without a system, that's where you'll always find whatever you're looking for in your barrel. So one way to help with that is some of these barrel organizers called barrel buckets. So these buckets are an easy way to lift your stuff in and out of the barrel. And uh, these are pocket organizers that fit around the outside of the barrel buckets that are inside your barrel. And then another item that is great for organizing is a cooler. This beast has got insulation all the way around, top and bottom, and a zipper opening that uh, keeps all those yummy things. We'll put that away. <laughs> keeps all your yummy food nice and cool, and uh, it also protects it from getting squished or damaged or bruised uh, if it's um, of that nature. So. What else you got here? What else do I got? In the cooler. Oh, in the cooler. Let's look. <laughs> okay. Oh, lovely tomato. Nice and fresh and not bruised. Oh, there's my ham steaks. Some nice sliced cheese. I put my egg container in here that keeps my eggs nice and cool. I got some peppers, lemon, and lime, depending on how you like your drinks. What else we got? What? What on earth is that? It's a dragon fruit! Are you afraid of dragons, Mr. Cat? I got some frozen meat in here um, that uh, I wrapped in uh, newspaper to keep it cooler. And uh, um, I've taken fresh meat for the first uh, four days of a canoe trip, so yummy. I got apples, orange, all sorts of yummy stuff. You? Yeah. No beer? In the past, I have taken a beer before, but only if I'm allowed. It's a great way to freeze a beer, put it in here. Helps uh, cool your stuff, keep it cool, and doesn't have the mess that uh, a bag of ice would if you put it in here. You make really good dirt, by the way. So I got, I tried some little ginger cookies in there this this time, and there's some crispy crunch uh, squares. And hey, look at that! <laughs> That's called hydrating right there. All right, these pocket organizers are really handy. There's three pockets that are closed with a Velcro closure, and inside you can put all your stuff that you want to. Uh, always know where it is. That's why there's color coding on uh, the different pocket organizers. And then you can go, okay, yeah, this is my uh, juice crystals in this pocket. I've got uh, my tea and sugar in another pocket. And I've got maybe my uh, porridge packages or other items in another pocket. So these pocket organizers are, are great for those things that you um, you use maybe across several meals like breakfast and dinner and um, but uh, you want to know where they are. Well, look, clod hopper. Oh, look at he's he's at <laughs> it again. <laughs> Stop. And how old is your tang crystals? <gasps> okay. Rumor has it that. As a canoe tripping partner, I have the oldest juice crystals um, possible. And um, certain uh, canoe partners have often teased me because they think that uh, my juice crystals have uh, lived a little bit beyond their best date. And, but I just want to show you that, that these are not rock solid. There's lots of flexibility left in these pouches of juice crystals. So 
I think the rumors are a little far-fetched. Or maybe they're true. Yeah. I don't know. Is there much to say about the barrel buckets? Oh, other than... you Are you rolling? All right. Barrel buckets are great um, for being able to get stuff in and out of your barrel uh, quickly. And the color coding helps you quickly identify, you know, what stuff is for dinner, what stuff's for lunch or breakfast, and, uh, and keep you organized. So different colors, different meals, and off you go. That's a good group. Yeah. So you can have some peanuts and raisins if you want. You're cut off. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>